Welcome to my YouTube channel Civil Engineering Easy. In this video, I will show you how to convert the volume of concrete from wet to dry. For more videos related to the quantity estimation, watch the quantity estimation playlist in my YouTube channel. Let's start the video. In civil engineering, quantity estimation, we usually calculate the wet volume of different structure elements like by multiplying the length with width and height. In wet volume, the volume of water is already included in the calculation. But in dry volume of concrete, there is no ratio of water. A factor we use to multiply the wet volume to get the dry volume. That is 1.54 for the concrete and 1.33 for the cement mortar. Before the discussion on these factors, let's concentrate on the conversion formula to calculate the dry volume of concrete. The dry volume of concrete is equal to the wet volume of concrete plus 54% of the wet volume. Let me to explain the concept briefly. If we have 1.54 cubic meter of dry volume of concrete, when we add water to this dry mix, the volume will reduce by about 54%. So that is why we need 1.54 cubic meter of a dry mix to get 1 cubic meter of the wet volume. For cement mortar, we have to add 33% extra to the wet mix. The formula to calculate the dry volume of cement motor is the dry volume of cement motor is equal to the wet volume of cement motor plus 33 percent of the wet volume if we need the quantity and dry volume on side how we can do that let's solve one of the short numerical suppose we have to make a cube from the concrete having all the dimensions is one meter the wet volume of cube can be calculated by multiplying its length, width, breadth and height. In this case, the volume will become 1 cubic meter. Now to calculate the dry volume of concrete, we have a formula that the dry volume of concrete is equal to the wet volume plus 54% of the wet volume. The dry volume of concrete will be equal to, so the calculated wet volume is 1 cubic meter plus 54% of the wet volume. The dry volume of concrete will become 1.54 cubic meter. Similarly, if we have to make a cube from the cement mortar having all the dimension is 1 meter, then the wet volume of the cube can be calculated by multiplying its length with breadth and height. In this case, the volume will become 1 cubic meter. Now to calculate the dry volume of cement motor, we have a formula that the dry volume of cement motor is equal to the wet volume plus 33% of the wet volume. The dry volume of cement motor is equal to 1 cubic meter is the calculated volume of cement motor plus 33% of the wet volume of cement motor. The dry volume of cement motor will be equal to 1.33. That was all about the dry volume calculation of the concrete and cement mortar. In the next part of this video, I will explain why we add 54% extra in the case of concrete and 33% to the cement mortar and how these factors has been derived. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.